and we'll talk about this a little bit for lung cancer patients, um, is that they have a higher rate of pneumonitis than other types of cancer where immunotherapy is utilized. For example, a melanoma was kind of the first um, tumor type where immunotherapy became a mainstay of treatment. But their pneumonitis rates, that pulmonary inflammation from immunotherapy is really low. It's 1% less. Um, but where in lung cancer, if you look at some of the meta-analyses, it's up to 13% of lung cancer patients can experience um, in pneumonitis from immunotherapy. So that is something really to focus on in lung cancer patients is that inflammation, shortness of breath um, that can be induced by immunotherapy. And then the other stuff is pretty typical that we see across tumor types, like the endocrinopathies, the hypothyroidism, the colitis, um, nephritis and hepatitis are uncommon, one to 3%, but they definitely happen. Just these other inflammatory. And then the derm conditions, again, less common in lung cancer, but more common in other tumor types. But something that we see frequently, I saw one this week, like a very strange kind of skin hypersensitivity almost reaction.